In this video we share Our Lady's message on God's justice and merciful love. Please like, comment and subscribe to assist me in sharing these messages with a wider audience. In Our Lady's message to the late Father Stefano Gobi, founder of the Marian Movement of Priests, the Blessed Mother said on January 21, 1984. The design of God's justice can still be changed by the power of His merciful love. Even when I foretell punishment to you, remember that everything can be changed in a moment by the power of your prayer and of your penance, which makes reparation. So do not say what you foretold to us did not come true. Comma, but thank the Heavenly Father with me because, through the response of prayer and consecration, through your suffering, through the immense suffering of so many of my poor children, he has again put off the time of justice, to allow the time of great mercy to flower. This message assures us of two things, that the time of mercy had been prolonged and that even if God's hand of justice falls on us, mercy is still available to those who sincerely ask for it. Mystics from all over the world, without communicating with each other are now telling us that the world has entered into the time of God's justice. Messages from heaven that warn of apocalyptic tribulations are largely ignored. This is likely the reason for the following message of the Blessed Mother to Gisal Arcadia on June 25, 2022. My children, thank you for having responded to my call in your hearts. Beloved children, in these special times, never abandon prayer and be conscious of the graces that descend upon you, always giving thanks. My children, you are favored in my eyes and before our Father. This is the reason for the apparitions throughout the world, in order that you might be warned of the dangers that you risk if you abandon God. Children, give thanks and have respect for the prophets who have been called to mission, they guide the church, meaning all of you. The church is not only made up of temples, Jesus himself has brought down the walls at times. My children, these are also times of grace and you will see many graces descend, they will serve to open the eyes of those who do not believe that heaven is united to earth and Jesus is close to each of you. Pray for Spain. Now I bless you in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Conversion was also the focus of the message of Our Lady of Medjugorje in her message to Visionary Maria on June 25, 2022. Dear children, I rejoice with you and thank you for every sacrifice and prayer, which you have offered for my intentions. Little children, do not forget that you are important in my plan of salvation of mankind. Return to God and prayer that the Holy Spirit may work in you and through you. Little children, I am with you also in these days when Satan is fighting for war and hatred. Division is strong and evil is at work in man as never before. Thank you for having responded to my call. Also, while recent messages from heaven say that priests will play a vital role in the transition of the world towards the triumph of the Immaculate Heart after unprecedented tribulations, they warn of bad priests. This was cited in the Blessed Mother's message to Gisal Arcadia on June 2, 2022 as follows. Dear children, thank you for being here in prayer and for having bent your knees. Daughter, you must tell the priests that their confusion is between the heart and the mouth, in this way they are bringing confusion among my children and they still do not understand that the transubstantiation of the bread and wine occurs with the consecration and the descent of the Holy Spirit who transforms them into body and blood and divinity. My children, pray much, for the earth is an immense desert and where there will be water, it will cause much damage. Children, my angels sing their lament because my son Jesus is torn with pain, pray and love my Jesus and remember that he died for you and to free you from sin. The Bishop of Rome will be attacked by the very people who support him. Now I bless you, in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. These days, many messages caused through mystics are confirmations of the era of tribulations now with us. There have been messages warning of shaking in the world, and some take this symbolically. In her message to Gisal Arcadia on April 3, 2022, however, the Blessed Mother was explicit in warning of an earthquake. Recall the message. Beloved children, thank you for having responded to my call in your hearts. My children, thank you for bending your knees in prayer. Daughter, see my bleeding heart, surrounded by a crown of thorns. 
My heart bleeds because you have not yet understood what God's justice will be, it will be worse than the day of the universal flood. Pray, children, convert your hearts, change your lives so that you would not be found unprepared. My children, there will soon be a strong earthquake throughout the earth to awaken your consciences, do not be asleep but keep watch. My children, everything is sick, the church will be judged because she has become only a political institution and is no longer trusting in God. Pray for pastors who have become lost, and pray for France. My daughter, you must tell people to reserve food and water in order to make provision for the dark times. My children, I now bless you in the name of the Most Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you, Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.